Hello, I'm Nora Bento Hello. I'm the team leader for the research and the title of our research is the effects of transmission implementations toward teaching and learning process. Our team member consists of Haris Rosline, Shushi, Shaki, then Yusuf Iskandar. TP Trustmaster started in, if I'm not mistaken, January 2011, which I think this is something like the first batch we take for the undergraduates. This is something that, you know, we have to respect. At that time, it's the Ministry of Higher Education. So they come up with the Trustmaster system. Okay, one of the reasons is because we need to cater with the global uh, demand you know, because of the whole world uh, index is on September. So we have January, we have May, and we have July for September. Yeah? Okay, and now it's 2015, means it's about what, four to five years already. Okay, this is something like considered not so new or not so long, I think, we implemented in GTP. Hi, I'm Sushi. I'm going to talk to you about the methodologies which we use for our research. There are actually two methodologies. The first is uh, conducting surveys. The survey which we conducted, we aim towards both the students and the academic staff of the university. This was because we wanted to get the op opinions of both the students and the teachers. Another method which we used was actually to have an interview with an alumni member and that would actually give us a comparison on how the bimester system was in the past and what are his views based on his data for the past and the future. The survey for the UTP student consists of five general questions uh, regarding their preferences, uh, academic excellence, teaching and learning process, and also personal affairs and workload. From the first question that have been asked, the result shows 64 out of 80 students preferred bimester system instead of trimester system. The students believe the bimester system could give them more time to study and at the same time enjoy their university life. The second question uh, is asking about the students' opinion uh, whether trimester system improved their learning process and 59 out of 80 students disagree. Most of them feel cramped by the short period of the trimester system. The third question shows all 80 of them agree that the changing of the system from bimester system to trimester system is affecting the teaching and learning process. The fourth question 53 out of 80 students are saying that trimester system is actually affected their personal life with their family and friends. Their holidays are with the family is also affected because the holiday is becoming so short because of the trimester system. Final question is asking about are they feel stressed about the trimester system during their studies? And half of them answered that they managed to study well, however, half of them, they couldn't really manage their time to study well and also doing other events in the university. So for the academic staff survey, we have prepared eight questions. For the first question, we asked about the teaching modules preparation. Teaching modules preparation means that how long will they take to prepare the module for every transition of the semesters. So majority of the uh, academic staff agreed that they prefer the bimester because it will be a longer time for them to prepare. So for our second question, it was about the implementation effects on work, such as the difficulties on either research or teaching. Majority of the academic staff agreed that they prefer the bimester because once the trimester was implemented, it became difficult for them to do research and also teach at the same time. So for our third question, we asked about the increase on number of faculty. Uh, this is a no-brainer for the academic staff. They agreed that as the number of students increase, it should reflect on the number of uh, faculty members to increase as well. For our fourth question, it relates to the facilities that were provided. Academic staff had a neutral response on the provision of facilities. Half of them provided uh, the answer, the amount of facilities were sufficient, while the other half reported that it was insufficient. Uh, for our fifth question, it was related to the lab maintenance. So majority of the academic staff agreed that the lab maintenance time was insufficient. So more downtime on the labs, hence no time for them to use the labs for their own research or teaching. 
So for our next question, six and seven is related to their personal time and their opinion on the working conditions. Majority of them reported that they are overworking and also uh, they lack personal time with family or with themselves. This is also to be caused by the implementation of the trimester. For question eight, it was an opinion-based question where we did ask uh, which one do they prefer, bimester or trimester. Uh, unanimously, they preferred the bimester and we chose the best answer among all which was with the bimester implementation, uh, the uh, bimester structure, they had uh, like academic staffs had more time to prepare and more time for them to use the equipments and facilities. Hence, it was a benefit for them instead of the current trimester structure. Uh, so all the statistics for 2001, for instance, uh, the number of first class graduates, uh, we have approximately 150 points. So, um, and I think in 2012, we have increased the number of what, 20 number of students. So it shows that you know at the beginning when we started the price master, yes, it's impacted a bit because in 2010, uh, the numbers is about 180, you know, 180 students was called for first class. You know. So slightly down and they go goes back on the track. So this is where I think it shows that though it's trust master, at the beginning people try to get the pace and get uh, the rhythm on how the trust master looks like. You know? But uh, I guess no, it's, we are doing quite okay you know, with the trust master system. Yeah, though the feedback from the lectures and students yeah, because they need to catch all the time. But now they are in the same place. From the result of the interview, we can conclude that the implementation of the trimester system does not affect the student academic performance except for the first year of the implementation. However, from the survey, we can conclude that the student and the academic staff is more prefer towards the bimester system. Based on our findings, we are recommended that Trismester structure has more disadvantages than advantages. Almost all the interview and the service academic staff in University Technology Petronas managements to revert back to the bi-semester. To solve this problem, bi-semester should be re-implemented to give benefit to teachers and also the students.